Hey everyone, here at the Quest Diagnostics Training Center East Rutherford. It's a big week for the Giants. So every week after access, after availability, after practice, we're going to do a little dispatch leading up to Sunday's big game, NFC East game between the Giants and the Washington Redskins. You know, Eli Manning spoke with us today. The big thing he said, he was asked several questions about the Josh Norman, Odell Beckham Jr. situation. He said he's not concerned at all about Beckham. He thinks that's in the past, that Beckham is going to focus on football. This is all about football. He doesn't feel the Giants are going to buy into the hype, the, the situation that Norman may want to pull Beckham into. He thinks Beckham's going to have his cool after last year's meltdown. He's not worried about Beckham. He sidestepped every question. So I think you're going to see that for the rest of the week. The Giants, of course, are going to be asked questions about Beckham and Norman, but I think the Giants are going to for the most part, keep their mouth shut. I could be surprised, but the Giants seem to really want to downplay the situation. Really candid comments today from linebacker Keenan Robinson, a former Redskin. He was there four years, signed with the Giants in the offseason. He said he's not surprised about the reports of dissension and discord and you know guy players speaking out and sniping at quarterback Kirk Cousins as Washington started 0-2. But he said he's lived it. He said every year, three out of four years he was there, he experienced the locker room where there was a lot of finger pointing, ups and downs when things went wrong. He said the only year they didn't have that was his rookie year 2012 when the Redskins won a division with RG3. He even said last year they had dissension. And he also had some pretty pointed comments, I think, about last year's Redskins team. He basically said that team, even though they won the NFCs, they didn't deserve to be a playoff team. He said the reason why they won the division was because Tony Romo got hurt in Dallas and because this Giants team had a terrible defense and couldn't close out close games. So, Kind of a slow day, you know, the players are back to work on Tuesday. That's what we had. We'll have a lot more going tomorrow. Ben McAdoo will speak for the first time as they officially turn the page to Washington. But it's a big game here on Sunday. Giants are 2-0 for the first time since 2009. They can really shut the door on the Redskins bury them at 0-3, and as Robinson said, the Redskins are going to be desperate for a win at 0-2. They're going to be doing anything they can to go home with a win. That's it for us here. Keep it here on NJ.com all week. We'll have full coverage as we build up to Sunday's big game, NFC East game between the Giants and Redskins. We'll see you next time.